This is West Cumbria, the wildly beautiful countryside where the Lake District meets the Irish Sea. It looks undisturbed and tranquil, but it's the centre of fierce controversy at the moment over the burial of nuclear waste. Canisters whose radioactive life would be counted in tens of thousands of years. At the moment, the government has had a consultation going on with local councils, Cumbria County Council, Allendale and Copeland District Councils, over whether in principle they'll take part and cooperate in a search for suitable sites in this lovely part of the Western Lake District and the seashore going round to the Solway Firth that might be suitable for burying the waste. This week, packed meetings in Maryport and Whitehaven heard from geologists about the possible risks of this sort of burial, about the uncertainty of geology. And vigorous debate continues between those who say that employment here, because this is known as the nuclear coast, we have Sellafield uh, here and uh, long-standing nuclear expertise, more than 10,000 jobs involved and not a lot else in this part of the world, at least not of that size, a certain amount of farming like these sheep here, but not a lot, um, between that side of things and those who say that the risks, the uncertainties of storing long-term radioactive waste are just unacceptable.